Hello, bio department. These are some students in my Calc 1 class, and they are, they're going to help you understand something about blood vessels. Take it away. problem they said that we had to find the resistance and like the best angle for blood vessels to branch off at and they gave us the formula for like the entire resistance to be this section plus this section and that's supposed to represent like blood vessels branching off and they named the section a d to be r sub one and then d to c to be r sub or just like Two, and then when you add the two together, you get total resistance. So that's this equation right here. And then... Because they gave you like the first equation, like yeah. K equals our resistance equals yeah. K. And then... Yes, we are assuming some basic physics about laminar flow. Yeah, that's uh, <laughs> uh, So True. then um, you, they set these three equations equal to each other, and then you can get to here, like these two equations, by substituting in... Uh, yeah, L sub 2 and by rearranging that one a little bit, L sub 1. And that's like trigonometry in the triangle. Um, yeah, fun. And then <laughs> you get to here, and then at that point you can take the der uh, derivative of everything. Why would you do that? Because they want to find the minimum amount of resistance, and in order to do minimum, you have to equal the zero. Then you have to like find common denominators, and well, then and then once you find common denominators, you can factor out um, s over um, sine two theta, and then because that's like a not like a number, you can just you can just multiply this part. You can equal this part to zero, and so then you get um, cosine of theta equals r two over r one, and then that's all to the fourth. Yeah. yeah. And would you like to finish that? So what does that mean? <laughs> That's like the least, if the, co if the angle is that size, then like the least of resistance you can get for blood pressure. Right? Yeah, right. And in particular, this one says that if the, if the smaller vessel is only three quarters as big around as the first one, then the, the appropriate angle for splitting is approximately 72 degrees. Plus or minus six degrees. Plus or minus six, right? Great. Shall we clap for them?